What's up, y'all? I hope you are having a great day. Today, I want to talk to you about God loves you. So I know there's so much going on between COVID, elections, just so much going on that I don't know how people may be individually working your nerve. <laughs> so my key thing is just reminding you that God loves you. God loves you. You know, so regardless of who don't like you, who hating on you, who doing this, who doing that, da, 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 God loves you. And it's just something about the comfort of hearing God loves me. You know, as it says in John 3, 16, for God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son, that whosoever believeth on him should not perish but have life everlasting. That's a key verse to remember. John 3, 16. God loves you. And I just really feel like somebody needed to hear that. Somebody needed to hear today that God loves them. That regardless of what someone else is saying, because I don't know, someone may have been mean to you and said something negative to you or whatever the case might be. Don't listen to them. Don't pay not one bit of attention to them. God loves you. Yes, God loves you. And that's something to focus on. You know, when everything in life is going, you know, hey, you know, all out of, you know, sync and everything. And you're trying to figure out this or that. That is just remember God loves you. It brings about a peace. And then the other one is John 14, 26, where it talks about, you know, he will guide you. He will lead you. And this is in the Holy Bible, too, as I'm giving out scripture. <laughs> Well, you know, uh, as Joyce might have told, we have to watch talking Christianese, you know, talking as if everyone just automatically knows <laughs> what we're talking about. So um, I'm talking, these are Bible scriptures that are in the Holy Bible, the Bible, King James Version, um, pick other versions too. But, um, but anyway, um, so just be motivated today. God loves you. And that's the key thing. I just really feel like somebody needs to know that. Because I think sometimes in life, people get caught on. They didn't do this right. They didn't do that right. They don't like it. And they miss the bigger picture of that God loves you. So it doesn't make a difference what somebody else thinks about you. It doesn't make a difference if you did good, you did bad, or whatever the case might be. It doesn't make a difference. God loves you. That is one of the key points. God loves you. So also, as God loves you, you should be loving on yourself. And you should expect other people to treat you with respect and love you. God's loving you, treating you with respect, doing you right. Don't let nobody walk over you. That's something for somebody too. You know, I see it all the time. Sometimes people are trying to do all these different things to try to get somebody to like them or love them. God loves you. You ain't got to be turning flips and tricks to try. <laughs> now, if somebody just love you, you know, and they showing you cool, showing you the love cool. But y'all know what I'm talking about. Those y'all just trying to do all this different stuff, trying to get somebody to show you love or to, to love you. And, you know, if they can accept you for who you are, you know, maybe then that's you not the one for them. You know, I'm quick to send people on. You trying to change and rearrange? You trying to straighten my head? No, nope, no, nope, no. Nope. You got to go. <laughs> my hair naturally is a curl pattern. And at this point, that's just what I want is my natural curl pattern. Not straight down. The <laughs> it's so funny. I was in the store. And they, yeah, I mean, now, so strangely, I, I don't know. You know, I guess this is what he was trying to envision when he can make me it. <laughs> It's like, oh my gosh, your hair is so long. If you straighten it out, it just really would be long. I ran from him. I did. Anywhere he was in the store, I went the whole other side of the store. <laughs> I don't like someone trying to make me into somebody I'm not. Or they're trying to make me do something I don't want to do. I'm not materialistic, so I just put on what I want to put on. <laughs> I don't give I like nice clothes and I do so, you know, I'm clean and all this stuff. But I'm just saying, you know, some people, they, they so materialistic that you got to have this, you got to have this person name on, you got to do it. <laughs> and that's not me. I'm like, if it's an outfit that I've seen and I liked and it's cute, I don't care if it don't have nobody name on it. Like some people talk about put your own name on your clothes. Quit paying all that money for somebody's name on your clothes. <laughs> anyway. I'm just saying. 
So for those of you that's turning tricks and flips, trying to get somebody to love you, first of all, if they're going to love you, you shouldn't have to work that hard. Okay. You know what I'm saying? So y'all might not be right for each other. How about that? To me, the person that's going to be right for y'all going to click. You're going to respect each other. I mean, all of us are different. So you may not, you know, agree on everything. But you can even agree to disagree on certain things. But they're going to like you. And you don't have to turn all these flips and tricks trying to get anybody to like you. So anyway, God loves you. <laughs> yeah, I know I'm a comedian. Actress has this great personality. You know what I'm saying? But I'm also an evangelist. Evangelist Michelle Hope Walker. Yes. <laughs> So I'm giving you a word today, Michelle Walker Ministries. Oh, let me date this too. Y'all know how I like to date stuff. So today is uh, Sunday and it is October 25th, 2020. So again, um, key thing, God loves you. God loves you. Don't let nobody else tell you nothing different. Don't let nobody tell you, you got to do this to earn God love. You don't do this. God don't love No, God loves you. There is not one perfect person, not one perfect person. Not one perfect part <laughs> to say that, you know, because we get our holier than that out there. Just, oh, you know, oh, you know, anything you do, anything you do, I'm like, oh my God, did you see my dog? <laughs> I don't know why I did that. <laughs> but don't get me wrong, we need them people too. And sometimes they, they do be really holy. <laughs> I mean, I'm supposed to be holy, but maybe they'd be a whole lot more holy than that. And so I guess they love us in their own way, trying to help check us, you know. But sometimes, you know, people don't need to be checking other people. They just need to be checking themselves first. <laughs> anyway, um, but we need them people. We need, you know, because you know. I, I, my thing is I'm always saying be who you are. If you that, oh, be you then, be you. I just know how to act around you. <laughs> And I know every once in a while I tell you, relax. Don't, every time you see me do something. Because <laughs> you're going to see me do a lot of something. So, you know, since you put sign and about to have an asthma attack <laughs> sound every time you see me do something that you don't agree with. Anyway, key point God loves you. <laughs> yeah, I know. I have this great personality and I love me. And see, this is who I am. You know what I'm saying? And so I enjoy me and I be me, you know, and preaching the word and act whatever I'm doing. I'm going to be me. You know what I'm saying? Don't get me wrong. I know how to act, you know, and, you know, when you're supposed to act at a certain time or something, but I'm just saying, you know, you clicked on to this and this is me, Michelle Hope Walker Ministry. So you clicked on. If you don't like it, click off. Anyway, God loves you. And that's what I'm talking about is that God loves you. So stay prayed up. You get up, do the, be the best you can be each day. Stay prayed up. Talk to God. God, what you want me to do today? And you just do what God called to you. Don't you worry about what nobody else. Don't. Don't. <laughs> don't. You stress yourself. <laughs> oh, God don't want that stress. Even in, I've always told you, John 14, 26 and verses 27, 27 talks about the peace. Peace. You know. So you stay prayed up and you know God loves you. And that should be hopefully relaxing for you to know that God loves you. You know what I'm saying? And hopefully that's relaxing. That you're like, okay, yeah, you're right. God do love me. God, God do love me. It'll make a difference what they think or what they say. God love me. Me and God cool. Sure. <laughs> Sometimes it be like that though. You know what I'm saying? You love other people, you love other people, but at the same time, when they won't play crazy on you, you got to be like, well, you know what? Me and God cool. And that's all that made me God happy with me. God loves me. And that's all that matters at this point right now. <laughs> you got to the head on them and the finger with them. Reach out, reach out, reach out. No, just wait. All right. So I'm your girl, Michelle Hope Walker. Um... And God loves you. And that's the key thing I want you to know. Hopefully I've made you even laugh. Just my natural personality and who I am. <laughs> but that's not like life is just too short to be sad and prune face. I remember uh, when my pastor talked about, look, you know, some people always get that look on their face like they suck it on the limit. You know, mm, you know, ugh. <laughs> be happy. You're already going through enough. We got COVID. We got an election going on. We neither one of them really <laughs> You know what I'm saying? 
so you just got to take time to laugh, smile, smile. God loves me. God loves me. You know what I'm saying? And then you just stay prayed up and keep doing what you think God calling you to do. And just, you know what I'm saying? To me, the one thing is, you know, when God don't want you doing something, because ooh we that will ring loud. Have you ever been somewhere and God be like, leave? You're like, but God, it's the church. <laughs> God may know something else about that church than what you know. Anyway, um, <laughs> pick your churches carefully. Pray. <laughs> Pray. Everybody that call upon the Lord may not actually be the Lord's. No, I'm just saying. But true though. But um, so anyway. <laughs> so stay prayed up. Don't be down on yourself. Stay prayed up. So I'm your girl, Michelle Hope. Walker. So I pray that you just be blessed today and that you stay prayed up, you stay focused, and you stay doing what God has called and told you to do. But the key thing is just stay knowing that God loves you. No matter what you do, God loves you. You heard somebody do something wrong, ask for forgiveness, ask them to forgive, whatever. It is. But get up, put a smile on your face, hold your head up, keep going, keep going. <laughs> All right. I'm your girl, Michelle Hope Walker. God bless. Oh, let me tell you, you can follow me on Twitter. You can follow me. It's um, at hope underscore speaks. It's the line on the line. And then um, Instagram, my Instagram won't let me post anything new, but my Instagram is Michelle Hope Walker speaks. And then my Facebook is Michelle Hope Walker speaks. Period. Listen. My mouth's chicken when I speak. You need to listen. Mm, no. <laughs> All right, y'all. All right, so have a good day. Remember God loves you. Stay prayed up. Stay doing you. And, and love people. Love people. Show people love and keep going, you know. But God loves you. So don't let nothing get to you. All right? All right. God bless. I'm your girl, Michelle Hope Walker. <laughs>